Hello, welcome. Today we will see the unboxing of Fire TV Stick. Um, so I have already an Amazon TV and uh, there is another TV which does not have an Amazon. So it's still a smart TV but I wanted to get the Amazon stuff on that TV. So I went for this Amazon Fire Stick which has got an inbuilt uh, Alexa voice. That's really good. This cost me $20 exactly 19.99 something um, there is one more model which is for 25 dollars but which comes with 4k but my tv is only maximum of 180p 1080p so i don't need a 4k edition um, here you can see so it supports it supports the wi-fi uh, ac version it's quite fast as it says quad core good audio with Dolby audio and HD 1080p and with Alexa um, what's included it's a second generation fire TV stick voice remote again a second generation and uh, two AAA batteries which is very much required for the remote and power adapter USB cable and HDMI extender cable internet obviously with Wi-Fi and HDTV with HDMI input. Let's see what's inside quickly. It's easy to open. Just follow this arrow and pull it off and it comes so smoothly. See, I'm able to just do it with one of my finger. So, so inside this orange box, you have a black box. There you go. It, it just opened up so nicely. So it was something like this. All I have to do is remove this one and it opens up i was very impressed with the packing so an instruction and then the, here is the fire stick and two AA batteries sorry the AAA batteries and the remote and this one is probably the hdmi cable set and here is the adapter wall outlet so let me unwrap all of these the remote i'm trying to insert the batteries So here is the final uh, remote. I just uh, put the batteries in and I put it back inside the cover so that it's dust proof. Um, I, I, I first tried it on my Amazon TV just to make just to check whether this remote functions on it. Fortunately, it did not work because I don't want somebody operating in my upstairs where this is meant for to change a channel or do something and which disturbs somebody else viewing in downstairs with the Amazon TV. So I'm glad that it did not interfere. Uh, it did not interfere that way. On my right, you would see that um, this is my Toshiba TVs, which is Amazon TV. So, so here is the fire stick. It says the model number LY73PR and nothing on the front except for Amazon. On the side it says HDMI and uh, this is where is the HDMI input which will plug inside the TV okay so on the side is where you have the power so you will still need to provide power to this fire stick so through this outlet you power the device and on this side you plug into this TV so that's how it works Okay, so they have given an HDMI to HDMI adapter. I wish they could have given an uh, adapter for those people who do not have an HDMI outlet instead. So this HDMI to HDMI is just like a small extension. So instead of plugging this part directly to the TV, all you will be doing is adding one more interface here. So this one goes to the TV. The male one and then there you have the female and then you connect this part basically it's just an extender i do not find it a real use behind this um, maybe adding a small length or for those guys who have problem in connecting to the hdmi side um, if it is too narrow or something if they have a trouble so this would be flexible enough in uh, going inside that something like that probably i guess for me this is a no big deal uh, i wish this could have been an adapter for someone else and this is the outlet 
um, so so this is the wall outlet over here you have an USB connection so this part of USB goes inside it and on here you have the micro USB connection type B um, you can see here it's a micro USB type B so this part goes into the side of the device which I have shown you before so this is the power part goes to the micro USB so this should be straightforward one two three and this one goes to the side four and this one goes to the TV so if you want to extend it use this otherwise it's no big deal and here is your remote which I have shown previously couple of instruction manual one says for fire TV stick the other one as well fire TV stick let's see what's different next generation Alexa voice remote do more with your fire TV so if you're already using an Amazon TV or uh, Alexa device so this is not something new it just says how to use your Alexa giving you some examples so this is again a not a pretty useful one at least for me and tips and troubleshooting so this may be helpful um, use the 5G band on your wireless rotary if available for best TV performance yeah but you should make a note that the 5G performs best if your router is close enough so that's the characteristics of 5G 5G is very fast but it's a shorter distance 2G is comparatively not that fast but it can penetrate uh, um, through the corners uh, cut through the walls but and it can interfere for a longer distance uh, it can communicate for a long day's distance. Mm. So it, it gives you basic instructions about how to connect to your device through Wi-Fi and then how to pair your remote for the first time. Okay, so this is why my battery was, n my remote was not working with my TV because uh, I remember that when I used my TV for the first time, I paired my remote with my TV. So which means my... Alexa remote was supposed to work only with my TV so this remote has not been yet paired so this will not work with any of the device including my fire stick until unless I pair my fire stick with my remote so in future if I have my problem with my remote using for the TV maybe I can pair this one with my TV then I can continue using this remote so that's how the principle of Amazon remote is so you need to pair the device before using it I just recalled it what I did initially for my TV before okay so what's in the box it said the same thing micro USB HDMI power USB cable this is the extender cable not of much use to me adapter AAA battery is already inside my remote and uh, finally connect your Amazon Fire Stick as I said this is the wall outlet extend the USB to the micro USB micro USB into the Amazon Fire Stick and the Amazon's HDMI to the HDMI outlet and here is the back of your TV and this is the extender portion if you want it um, remote pairing and all those things and finally power up your Alexa remote open the back of the remote and insert the included after pairing it or follow the on-screen instructions to control the power and volume okay complete the on-screen setup so once you insert the device basically Amazon will run you through like how to register how to pair your device and all such things okay um, again once again how to use Alexa here and this is the safety instructions terms and policies limited warranty yeah your fire sticks is covered by a 90 day limited warranty please note guys this is not even a one year product this is only 90 days so warranty is 90 days cost is 20 dollars second generation model number rating 3 volt temperature yeah that's it